Hey there, webheads! Welcome back to the channel today. We're tuning into some musical mayhem as Miles Morales dives into the mystery of the Cultural Center robbery in Spider-Man 2. In this episode, titled Hard Bop, our boy Miles is on a mission to save the soul and the saxophones of the city's musical heritage. Will he hit all the right notes? Or will the bad guys turn this rescue into a sour tune? Hit that like button, get ready to groove, and let's go catch some culture thieves. Hey, you've reached peak. Uh, it's good enough. Leave a message. Where the hell are you, Pete? Hey, Genki. Hey, dude. One of the friends got its wires all crossed with an old hunter transmission. Figured you might want to look into it. Maybe it'll lead to Lee. I'm sending you the source coordinates. Really appreciate it, man. No problem. Everything good? Haley and I are a little worried. It's okay. I just need everything to get back to normal first. I'll make it up to her, though. We're missing her exhibit. Okay, dude. Hope the lead pans out. and saw an old phone number on that truck you chased down. I may be onto something. Can you come meet your mama for lunch at the park by my office? Chop cheese on me. Any clue is a good clue. If we can't find that truck, the museum will have to close. Plus, I never turn out a chopped cheese. So the phone number on the impounded truck was the pre-1970s kind with letters. Harlem 7, 4321. Did the truck that got away have the same one? Yeah. But I'm not sure I'm following. <laughs> Pre-1970s trucks were terrible polluters because they had no catalytic converters. My office did an initiative to get them off the roads. So there are now very few old trucks in this neighborhood. Si tuviéramos alguna forma de localizarlo. I got an idea. Nice work, Ma. Back in business. If Ma's right about those trucks, they probably left behind some kind of residue. Hey, Miles. I heard there's a scar-studded gala at the museum. If I find the missing pieces, yeah. Never been to a gala before. Do you want to go? Thought you'd never ask. What should I wear? Here's black, Loki glam. Bro, let me focus. Right. Uh, good luck. I can't believe people would do this. I was so excited about this exhibit. The whole museum, really. Look, this is an unfortunate situation I'm in here. I mean, you know how much I care about protecting the collective history of this community. I do, which is why I hope this won't derail your support. OK, let's see if those trucks left anything behind.
Spider-Man's here. Spider-Man, any news? Working on some new leads. I'll let you know. Well, I've got business to attend to, but you know my feelings. For me, it's about preserving the history at all costs. <laughs> hey, Spider-Man. Now we know you're helping on this. You're good. Thanks. This looks like it could be something from a prehistoric heist truck. Ugh. Smell that sulfur. Definitely from an old engine. Maybe I can isolate it further. To identify the substance, I need to get rid of the contaminants. Let's try that again. <laughs> I don't avoid destroying the anchor nodes. Let's see here. hydrocarbon. This will never make it through a catalytic converter. Hey, Ma, you were right. That truck was so old, it left a unique contaminant in its wake. Fantastico. Can you track it down? On it as we speak. I suddenly have hope we might really be able to find everything, pull off the gala, and save the museum. Whoa, 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 whoa. One thing at a time. Okay, I know. Well, be careful, and let me know what you find. Sorry, couldn't hear you. Anyway, we delivered everything we had, and the rest of it fell off the truck. Then you better frickin' find it! I understand, sir. We'll keep looking for the last item. He's stiffing us. What did I tell you? No. He'll pay when we deliver the saxophone. No. Saxophone. I think you know where. Settle down, idiot. This guy's loaded. Just need to make him happy. I am done. I'm gonna go find that guy and take my money. You're gonna blow the whole deal for all of us. I'm with him. Let's go find him and demand our cash. You guys have no patience. Huh? Well, hang on now. All clear. But stay on your toes. Nobody saw that, right? your cooperation.
sleepy time. Okay, that's all of them. Let's open up that truck and get the rest of those museum pieces. Empty. They must have already given their boss whatever was in here. All roads seem to lead to that guy. Sounds like somebody's phone. Okay, so there's something out there they're still looking for. So I found the second truck, but it was empty. Oh, no. But they lost one of the pieces somehow. Charlie Parker's saxophone. Oh, Miles, head over to C.J. Walker Park. Okay, why? One of our interns said she heard a guy talking about a saxophone he found. I didn't believe her at first. She's kind of a... If it's the one these guys lost, the boss seemed really interested in finding it. As he should be. Charlie Parker's a legend. That saxophone is priceless. Who should I look for at the park? I don't have a name. They said a trumpet player was talking about it. Trumpet. Got it. Thanks, Tiaranita. Let me know what happens. Te quiero. Okay, where is this trumpet guy? This place looks a lot better today than it did when Fisk and his crew took it over. Hey, Miles. Steph, what's up? You here with Gloria? Nah, she's working. I just got here. Was looking for a trumpet player. You seen one anywhere? Yeah, Teo is here, playing his trumpet. Teo plays trumpet? Mm-hmm. I think he was over near that far gate. Great. Thanks, Steph. And say hi to Gloria for me. It's just basic drums are good. They have the volume of the good volume dynamics makes it a little bit. Thanks, everyone. Hey, Spider Man. Hey, Miles. Teo. Sounding good, man. Wow, I didn't know you played the trumpet. I dabble, I dabble. Hey, I was actually gonna call you. When I was in keynote music this morning getting my horn fixed, some kids brought in a sax they found on the street. I was thinking it could potentially be the one from the museum. I don't want to get anyone in trouble. I'm trying to do the right thing. Yeah, 100%. You talking about keynote on Cathedral? Yeah. Talk to Eugene. Thanks. Headed there right now. Trumpet sounds great, bro. Hey, Ma. Found the sax. On my way to pick it up now. Ay, bendito. Angela will be so relieved. This just might save the museum. Hey, did you know Teo played the trumpet? He's pretty good, too. Had an audience and everything. The whole park was bumping. Precisely why this museum is so important. Music enriches our community and brings it together. Is that my mom or Councilwoman Morales talking? It's both. Ten cuidado, mijo. Uh-oh. This doesn't look good. Hey, Spider-Man! I was about to put an alert in your app. What happened here? A couple of creepy guys just dragged Eugene out of here. Definitely wasn't right. They went that way. Thanks. I'll check it out. Let's scan for any clues here. Hey, fellas. You want to learn to play music? 
There are better ways to do it. Get the spider! Get him. Man, here comes the rest of the band. Spider-Man. You okay? A few bruises are okay, as long as they left me my keys. Here, take these and open my trunk. Charlie Parker saxophone. That's the real deal right there. I was getting ready to return to the museum, and those guys busted in. He used that to record his masterpiece, Ornithology, 1946. You a bird fan? <laughs> My dad was. I don't know much about old music. Mm, mm, oh. <laughs> when you hear an MC today, use syncopated accents, stress the offbeat, flow in and out of the rhythm. That ain't nothing but bebop. I have to listen a little closely next time. I'll get this back to the museum right away. Then I gotta call my insurance company. Okay. Thanks, man. Right. Hmm. If I could get into the phone these guys were using to communicate with the mastermind. <laughs> All zeros is a number equivalent of password as a password. Just a midnight rendezvous with a criminal mastermind. No biggie. Take down the boss with this operation and find the rest of those museum pieces. I'll just hang for a bit until the party starts. You were supposed to pay us on our last delivery. You'll get paid when I get everything. Where is it? Where is what? Lewis said you were bringing the saxophone. Lewis said? Lewis got picked up by the cops. He don't got no saxophone. You set this meeting up! No, we didn't. Now where's our money? Where is the saxophone? Darren? The big donor from the museum? Better bust up this party and have a talk with him. I should get the whole bunch wrapped up before they hurt someone. We're fed up with you not paying us. We don't work for free. I think maybe we need to show you how we feel. With our fists. Uh, yeah, hang on now. We should have never trusted you in the first place. What are you even doing here? If you're not gonna pay us, we're gonna steal that stuff back. Okay, okay, let's talk about it. We're not talkers, we're doers. It's our turn to run this show. You've got so much money. Let's see some of it. Take a step back. Yeah! Ooh. 
What's he doing here? We need Leon with the big gun. Spider-Man, help me! I'm just trying to get the stolen things back to the museum. Give me a break, Spider-Man. I can explain. That's gonna have to be a longer conversation. Well, that seems to be all of them. Let's get to the bottom of this with Darren. Well, thank you, Spider-Man. I assure you, there's a very reasonable explanation. That seems extremely dubious. Wait till Councilwoman Morales hears you were involved in this. Leon's here! Time to exterminate a spider! Darren, stay back. his number. Sounds like he's close. Bad guys on Darren's tail. Can't blame them. They want their money. Who is this? Is this Lewis? Darren, stop the car! Spider-Man? Can you at least stop these guys chasing me? You weren't trying to retrieve those things. You were the one behind the robbery in the first place. I care about these objects. You pretended to care, and then stole from the museum. It's this community's history. It's my family's history. I don't expect you to understand. I don't think I'm the one who doesn't understand. Let's get these other bad guys out the way first. Gotta stop this and put all these guys behind bars. The police are on their way. Gotta catch up to Darren. Oh, are you still there? Look, my father was one of the most successful music producers ever. He produced half the artists in that museum. Good for him. Now stop the car and tell me where the rest of the pieces are. Which one was the break? I should probably get my license one of these days. Just so I get this right. All that talk of supporting the museum, all Angela's time you wasted asking about operations and security, all lies. So you can learn how to steal the collection. For my family. No. I'm sure you do care about this music. But those things don't belong to you. They belong to this community. Let's go, sir. You're under arrest. This event would not have been possible without our wonderful curator, Angela, mm -hmm. and this entire community. The way we pulled together to recover the stolen items is nothing less than amazing. 
Okay, okay. Thanks to every one of you for saving me. And thank you, Rio Morales, our city council, who just visit those nations. All that? And she was a secret agent fighting Nazis? Huh. Josephine Baker, role model. Hey, I heard you helped find the missing saxophone. Yeah, I got to hold it. Bird coax miracles from that hunk of metal. My dad was a big Charlie Parker fan. He'd be happy to know the sax is here for everyone to appreciate. And maybe lead them back to the music. Music mm, is magic. Miles, isn't this place awesome? I'm embarrassed to say I've never been here before, but after hearing about the robbery, I thought I'd better come check it out. From what I heard, that guy convinced himself all this stuff rightfully belonged to him. Crazy what some people can convince themselves is true. Hey, I guess it all worked out. This museum is fire, and so much music I want to go listen to now. <laughs> right? Bro, it's so inspiring. Hey, you want to have breakfast tomorrow? I can tell you all my new music ideas. Let's do it. I'm going to keep checking this out. Too many people. Got to go around. so cool how other people have been able to do music and save the world stuff. Angela, I'm Miles, Councilwoman Morales' son. Miles, she talks about you all the time. Congratulations on the exhibit. I'm glad it all came together. Thanks to your mom and Spider-Man, of course. Oof, this neighborhood is blessed to have them both. Hey, Miles! I figured I'd better come see that saxophone in its rightful place. It was your tip that helped with the saxophone recovery. Oh, not really. It was all our Spider-Man. The guy, not the cat. Well, it was a community effort. Give your Spider-Man some ear scratches for me. I will. Finish looking around before I go talk to Ma and head out. Huh. So basically, Bebop let musicians show off. Eugene was right. That is what MCs do. <sighs> Gotta listen a little more closely. Thank you all. Thank you so much. <laughs> Angela told me the museum has a record number of new memberships. Seriously? They're gonna be okay. <laughs> Couldn't have done it without you, Ma. Now hear me out. What if we really teamed up on the next one? I can get my own suit. Ma! Maybe. Algo con brillo. Ma, stop. Stop. <laughs> Stop it. Get out of here. <laughs> Dance with me. Show me how to sauce. Hey, <laughs> That's a wrap on Miles' jazz-infused detective work. From web-slinging to rhythm-swinging, 
our Spidey didn't miss a beat in protecting the city's musical past. If you loved Miles' moves and this sweet side quest, make sure to subscribe, like, and share the love with your friends. Drop a comment on your favorite Miles moment and ring that notification bell so you never miss a beat on the next episode. Until then, keep it cool, keep it jazzy, and keep swinging, Spider fans!